Hello everybody, welcome to part 29 of my banjo Tui walkthrough, and here we are right next to the flight pad. So we are about to take flight, and I decided to go ahead and fight the douchebag shooting fireballs at me, and I believe he is way up here. Okay, so that's a forced fire side, he missed. I'm trying to remember if I went into there or not. Wait, that's actually just a graphic or something that was kind of weird looking, but... Okay, so I kind of I looked it up and I I was I was wanting to know if I can actually fight him, you know, like right now and not have to worry about any type of problem with him. But as it would seem, there's not much of any problems. So we are about to fight Chili Billy, the hot and spicy dragon. Oh god, that's not good. Alright, so... So the trick right here is, of course, to use the ice eggs against him. And that's, of course, you know, the weakness of... I guess, fire. Alright, so now we're on... Oh god. Oh, he does two damage to me? That... I got lucky right there. So he did two damage to me. What? All right, so there's two now. Good thing to do is to um, have a head start when you're jumping over his tongue because it kind of, at times it kind of messes up. All right. So that is number one turret down. About to have, oh, there we go. This reminds me of the fight with uh, Gruntilda in the original game. And the enraging that I was going through in that game. Am I in front of it? No. Oh, God. I'm just on top of it. Alright. So there's... Two hits now. I can probably still use that, but I am not going to. I'm just going to keep going on. Uh. Alright. And we are done. Huh. Look how small he actually is. <sighs> he wants some big owl burgers, apparently. Okay, so do we get the G? Oh, no, we go. Okay, so we have to beat the. We have to beat the the brother first, and then we can actually get the uh, the the jiggy for it. And that's all right. We just wanted to do that because obviously he was annoying. There was a lot of problems with the uh, with the fireballs and ah oh, crap. Oh well, that's fine. I won't need ice eggs anymore anyway. So. The few uses of actual uh, ice eggs, eggs. Oh god. Okay. Um. So, obviously, uh, well, I'm almost dead, <laughs> for one thing. Okay. So we have um a decent amount of things already, but we're about to get our second jiggy of the world, and the first since we got here actually, because the only got the only one that we got so far was the um. Uh, was the one technically from, that was a lot of saliva, um, anyways, technically from, oh god, what's the place called, oh Christ, what is this, okay, oh god, 
I still have to be solo right there. I believe I know exactly what this is for, too. Oh, yep. Okay. But anyways, um, we were either at Pterodactyl Land or we were... Oh, yeah, yeah, actually, you know what? It, we were. We were at the Stomping Plains. Uh, we had... Uh, went through that little uh, Stomping Plain area and we managed to get the... Uh, the, the switch or something like that, and we were we were here. I'm not, I don't remember where exactly we were, you know, we, we were, but we we were apparently. Okay, so uh, here we are at the Coliseum one more time, getting attacked by random fireballs. So we're gonna go through to get to Mayhem Temple again, and what we're gonna do here is we are going to become a stony and we are going to do the second kickball game hopefully it's easy but I don't know I don't remember too much um, so in this video it's gonna be uh, pretty well planned uh, it's gonna be mostly about getting jiggies in this one um, you know and if we run into any Jinjos or anything like that along the way that's okay uh, but I think mostly it's gonna be about like I said about getting jiggy so we're about to get jiggy with it we just got to figure out how difficult this jade snake grove I don't remember that just got to figure out how oh Christ um how hard this is gonna be but I, I think it's gonna be easy so we're gonna be good what should be hard as hell? I'll be upset. Alright, head to this over here. And I should have done this last video, but oh well. I was kind of overwhelmed by the uh, by the level in a sense, so. I'm well prepared in this one. Alright. What? I'm sorry? <laughs> the lowest score wins? Oh god. Alright, so I just covered there real quick. I got hit by a fireball and I just uh, paused it for a little bit. So apparently we need... What are the, oh, they're the, uh, the mean looking guys. So we need to get the, the lowest scores it seems. Uh, so how does this work? I mean, do they... Oh, that's right. I bet you we have to score in people's, uh... Yep, we do. Awesome. Okay, I got two points right now. Douchebag? Alright, yellow for sure is... Uh, no! Oh, damn. Okay, so I got four right now. <laughs> Purple is going to lose, too. I kind of like this, actually. I, I didn't think that we can actually... Oh, no. That's all right. I have six right now. Alright guys, service card right there. I'm having trouble with the number two. <laughs> we have to actually shoot it into our our net this time, and it's kind of I was slower to the roll. I can only imagine what the uh, the next one's gonna be like, because uh, I didn't realize how fast these guys were gonna actually gonna be next to me. That's kind of lame. That was. Come on, Jesus Christ. That's gonna hit the wall probably, or it's just gonna keep into that little Alright. I 
That won't make it, but oh well. Okay, so we uh, we won this one pretty easily now. I think it was just bad RNG for me. Alright guys, Swords Card right there, now we are back at the final. Uh, I'm trying to win, but uh, I'm getting terrible RNG. So the, the problem I'm having right now is trying to... Uh, so uh, what I need to do is I need to stop doing that, I guess. So each, each yellow ball gives you four. And it seems like... They were ganging up on me for a while. Alright, so we have three. Now we have five. Alright, so each of them guys have way more points than they... So yeah, I got this now. And unless something crazy happens, but nope, we're good. Alright, so it took me a, f a few times. They, you know, it's like I said, it, it really is based on RNG. And now I am the new Coliseum Kickball Champion. And we get a Jiggy from it. Alright, so it was a pretty cool, uh... Oh god, which way? Oh, that's it right. This is it right here. So this is a pretty cool, um, you know, blast from the past, having to do this stony thing one more time. And, uh, I guess while I revert back to my normal self. I'm going to probably do a few more things. Uh, I forgot which one I had to go to. Uh, it's going to be one Um So the first thing, I'm going to finally go to the uh, the ice uh, side of Hellfire Peak. And we are going to um, see what that tent is, is, is about. Uh, the green tent that was in the beginning of the in the fire side. Um, and and then I'm gonna do probably probably one more thing. And it's actually in the Coliseum with us right now too. And that where I showed that little switch that was on the outside where I, uh, where I flew up to it. Um, that's actually. If I'm correct, that's actually one of the things that we need to to step on to get the Jiggy. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Fireside first. Um, uh, let's see. Cause, uh, yeah, technically, yeah, let's do Fireside first. Or Ice Side, I mean. Go to Ice Side. Uh, see if we can't save him quickly. I don't know, actually... Um, oh, that's right, I must fall off again. All right, so we're, we're, what we are going to do is we're going to teleport to Mumbo, because that is the easiest way to get to Ice Side, and then we are going to, it's going to be a process if I'm correct, we got to do a few things just to get to, uh, oh wait, Oh wait, no. Is this good? No, it's not good because we... Yeah, we're not even close to it. I forgot. Alright, so that's actually Mumbo's little thing right there. Alright, so we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. Alright, I forgot it was just like literally literally right here. Just shut down it right down here. That way we don't have to go through the hands. And it feels great not to have the, the fireballs shooting at us every five seconds, it seemed like. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, I had to go this way. Oh, wait, I had to go to the... Oh, Christ, I forgot. I had to go through those hands anyways. Um, and should be one more, and here we are. All right, so let's head up to Mumbo and give him the Globo. And 
time to send him to Ice Side. All right, let's head over past this right here. Yes, I do. Throw that into there. All right, is it, that has to be a bird's nest. I'm pretty sure it's a bird's nest. All right, right here. This is gonna be like the first time Mumbo is actually gonna be in Wumbo's uh, tent. This is gonna be funny. Big heap trouble, huh? Kind of reminds me of uh, Sunset Riders with that. Okay, so we just uh, seen our first death of, uh, well, no, a second death, actually. Because, uh, Bottles died first. Alright, and here he is right here, RIP Mr. Alien Guy. Okay, so I'm actually not sure where the location of what we're trying to do here is. Uh, but we will find it eventually. And very soon we'll... Yep, here he is. Oh, God. Stop it. God. Oh, sh... How impolite, douchebag. Oh, God. Why is there so many death things around here? I'm just trying to find one guy. I don't know what you guys want from me. Can I walk on there? Wait, is it right? Is that it right there? Oh yeah, if you walk into that, you you'll get hurt. So don't do that. Try to avoid things. What is that? Oh, here he is, right here. What is that, anyways? Oh, it's a piece of treasure. Okay, so I'm pretty sure what we need to do is we need to go up. Oh, Christ. We, we got to get a top of this thing right here, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's actually where it is. And is it going to be possible to do? I don't remember. All right, nice. Oh, God. Get it, Mumbo. Okay, was this? Okay, oh, sweet. Here we go. Nice. Get some notes on the way up. What is this? Oh, it's a... I bet you it's a Minjo. Oh, that's right. That thing's actually alive, and we'll, uh... We shall fight that soon. Okay. I'm pretty sure the person that's in here is actually a, uh... A former... Oh, God. Oh, please don't fall off. All right, here we go. Saber Man. Nineteen eighty four. 
Okay, so I'm actually not sure what game he's talking about. I- Oh, Jesus! Oh, my legs. Oh, God. He, he has some good-ass aim. He could have taught his brother a few things, that's for damn sure. Okay, so that was, uh... That was a pretty interesting cutscene. Um, I don't know. I think it's actually over here. Here it is. I think. Oh, there it is right there. Where's Wombus? So I'm pretty sure there's another one gonna be uh, right there. So if I wanted to, I could probably go up there too, but I think I'm gonna wait on that. Unless I actually can go up here. But I'm pretty sure we'll slide down. Yep. All right. So we'll we'll have to find another way up there, but that's all right. We can we can uh, we can come back for that. All right. So this this makes me wonder if uh, if Mumbo is actually stronger than uh, than Wumba or not. Because you have to think. I mean, reviving somebody back to life, you know, the life is that's a pretty interesting. Uh, skill Mumbo has. Okay, so now we can go back and use a fire egg to heat up Mr. Saberman. And in doing so, we shall reach the... Oh, Christ, I have to go back over here. And in doing so, we will run into... I think we have to do one more thing to actually to help him out. I'm pretty sure he's uh, if I'm correct, anyways, I'm actually not sure. We shall find out. We eventually gotta find the Globo, too. And this is one place I, I don't remember what the transformation is. Okay, obviously, fire eggs are on our... Okay, I'm not sure what that is, but... Uh... Alright. So, oh, here we go. Nice. Some more, uh, some more notes. Oh, God, that hurts. Sweet. All right, so now we can teleport back here. Okay, so I was kind of dreading this, actually. My... My first recording of this level, I was just like all terrified of it for a minute, and then I just kind of... I think this level, or this video in general, just kind of cured that, so... I think we're going to be good to go. What? I have to do it a few times? There we go, and I think he's heated up. Forty winks. All right. So what's funny is uh, forty winks. If I'm correct, if it's the um. If it's the correct game uh, title that I'm thinking of, it was actually a scrapped. It was I, I think it came out for the P the, the PlayStation, but uh, it was going to come out for the N64 too, but it was canceled. But it was a platform game, a three another three 3D platformer game that. Uh, where was that at? Oh, it was up here. That's right. But uh, that, that was, that's one game I would like to eventually get for the PlayStation and. Uh, I've been doing a lot of 3D platformers, and of course, Lefum and me finished up Chameleon Twist 2. Uh, but uh, eventually, I'd like to get uh, 40 Winks and just uh, and try that out. 
Oh, Christ. Those of you guys who have watched a few of my videos know that my th uh, my actual favorite genre, genre in gaming is uh, 3D platformers. All right, come here. All right, so I'm not sure why he is uh, unable to go back himself, but but that's all right. We'll uh, we'll give him a handout. Okay, where was that at again? It's right over here. I could probably just go this way up. Can I? Yes, I can. Nice. All right, so we'll just teleport. Make it easy. Okay, so now that we have done this, um, I kind of want to do one more thing, but I think I might wait on that until next video. Doing these uh, few things we've done so far kind of just... You know, we've done a decent amount so far. All right, so Saberman is retiring. He is no longer going to be an adventurer, apparently. Or at least momentarily, one of the two. And he's out. I always love seeing, like, the, the minor characters in games, like, uh... Like him, Saberman, or, um... A character like uh, who am I thinking of? Um, a character like Gobi or something like that. All right, guys, towards so cover there. We are not doing what I th was wanting to do uh, because I think I might have to wait uh, for a certain move. Uh, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Just, just doing a few things. I feel pretty pretty good about this video uh so stay tuned for some more banjo Tui where we s well yeah we'll be on part 30 so this will be getting up there in uh in numbers soon so i'll see you guys in part 30 thanks for watching and i'll see you guys then